with some areas of Lubbock seeing a little over or very little rain over the last six months. Some farmers and their crops are hurting pretty badly. KLBK's Grace Morris has more. That's horrible. It should be open at least that big. Since the start of cotton season, cotton farmer Stephen Brosh hasn't had much luck with Mother Nature. All bowls like that just means poor quality seed and poor fiber. Got drier and drier and drier and here we are. We're right back to, I doubt we'll harvest any uh, dry land. If we do, it's going to be very little. With Lubbock seeing little rain in the last six months, the severe drought has hit farmers hard. The drought situation that we're in is one like we haven't seen in quite some time. And while irrigation can help, nothing beats good old-fashioned rain. Our irrigation is only supplemental to our rain. And without rain, we're, we're, without Mother Nature's help, it's, it's impossible to grow the kind of crop that we need. Moisture rainfall is prime, I mean it is our first limiting factor for production. According to Utley, because it has been so dry, some counties might lose almost 90% of their cotton crops. There's, there's not another segment of farmers, in my opinion, around that know how to grow a crop better than what we have in West Texas and these cotton farmers. They just need the help of Mother Nature. Meaning farmers like Brosh could lose most of their crops even after all their hard work. Uh, punch the gut, really. You know, you work, work 14, 15, 16 hour days just trying to keep it going and when it's all said and done, if you don't get the rains, Mother Nature doesn't help you some. It's, you did it all for nothing, really. Leaving Brosh to just hope better for next year. Yeah, it's just bad all around. We just, we kind of need to just move on. Grace Morris, KLBK News.